What's going on guys? And welcome back for another video. We're gonna take a break today from our regular Mustang content to showcase and mod something new that we're driving in right now. You know that we just picked up this 2022 Mustang GT. We've been making a lot of progress with mods with that thing. But the funny thing is we actually picked up this truck before the Mustang. We took advantage of those Ford special rates. This is a 2022 loaded XLT. We're gonna go out here to the spot, a little walk around showcase and show you the new vehicle because we have a lot of things in store for this truck because today we're doing exhaust. Kind of a two for one video. Getting started. And our new 2022 Ford F-150 XLT FX4. You name it, it's got it. This is a loaded XLT trim. This is the new like family vehicle. So we got the Mustang, we can go fast with that, but this is the new family daily. Truthfully, these 3.5 EcoBoost engines, which is what this has, can be hard to make sound good. That you'd almost kind of like want to leave it alone stock, but hopefully we can have some good luck. We're gonna give it a Juni Varsity try with help from our friends from Corsa Performance. You guys know that we are Team Corsa on this channel. I love this truck. This is like my new favorite vehicle. We want it to sound good and look good. We decided to go with something pretty cool that's going to, I think, look really good on the truck and I think that you guys will really appreciate. So let's get up here, let's make a right-hand turn. Let's get up here and do a little walk around and get our exhaust clips done and then we're gonna head back to the garage and start tearing this puppy down and put some more noise under this truck from Corsa. Let's go. All right, we have some nasty weather coming in, so we're gonna try to make this somewhat fast. Here we go, behind us, we have our blue F-150. Check this out. Look at this beautiful baby right here. So, FX4, four-wheel drive, XLT, loaded to the teeth. This is like one of my new favorite vehicles. This thing is amazing. Everybody needs a truck. I mean, honestly, if you own a house, you have a family, you need a truck. But we want it to sound the part and that's what we're gonna be doing today. So let's just do a little spin around the vehicle, show you the ins and outs. So 2022, we did take advantage of the Ford special financing rates. So my payment on this is like only like $25 more than uh, Explorer that we had. This is it. This is our new EcoBoost 3.5. FX4 2022 Ford F-150 and here we guys go you guys know how these things look so we got it all cloth interior I don't care for leather and trucks I just it doesn't bother me if it has it or not but I mean you guys know it's a truck so this is it all right we do want to lift this thing a little bit higher it's gonna be coming in the future at some point we're gonna do some kind of suspension work on this vehicle but we have in the garage right now some parts ready to go under the hood for more power, but that's gonna be coming in a later video, so just stay tuned to this channel if you wanna see what in the world we're doing to a 3.5 EcoBoost. Make sure that you are subscribed here and for regular Mustang content as well because we're gonna be doing some big things here real soon. But before we head back to the garage, I forgot, we gotta do the exhaust sound clips like it is stock so we know where we came from and how loud it has gotten and improved with the Corsa Systems stock exhaust clips, let's go. All right, so really quiet. So let's see if we can wake this thing up. But the trick here is that we want it to sound good because like I said, a lot of these trucks, when you do exhaust on these things, if it's not a V8, it don't sound all that great. But hopefully we can get some proper noise, some good sound from the Corsa system and it's gonna look a whole lot better. We have to move the Mustang out of the way. So let's do that. All right guys, so sneak peek. We have headers for the Mustang out there. So get ready for even more loud and more power and we got a blower on the way. Get this thing unboxed, let's go. Here is the main show. This is a full catback system. And we got black tips, of course. Look at that. You see the size of this muffler right here? Let's go into the truck and show you how big this one is. That's what we are gonna replace. That is massive. We got clamps, got a pipe, got an adapter, much smaller muffler, another pipe, and then of course, 
these guys right here, the black tips that's going to basically live and replace this single side exit behind the tire right here. All right guys, we have the Corsa installed. I mean, honestly, it's simple. You can do this in like 30 minutes and Corsa includes some really detailed like how-to instructions. Now it is time for our first warmish cold start on our F-150 with Corsa. Let's hear it. <laughs> screaming loud not yet we're gonna get on it we're gonna go for a little bit of a driving review on how this thing sounds inside of the cabin with windows up down so on and so forth with revs and all that stuff you know how we're gonna do we're gonna keep it as detailed as possible but let's take a look so we have the black dual tips behind the rear tire and they look so good so the muffler actually gets replaced all the way basically up underneath this door here there's a new muffler and then basically just straight piped all the way back. So definitely a weight savings here compared to the stock. We deleted the big rear muffler in the back and the resonator uh, that lives kind of like in that vicinity. So basically this is, should be a lot louder on the street, but of course it is known for anti-drone technology. It's kind of like being able to have your cake and eat it too with Corsa. So anyway, I digress guys. Let's get on the road. Let's see how this sounds. And is this something that we can live with on a day-to-day -day basis? Let's find out. So. Now it's time for our first in the cabin start with our new Corsa system. Let's go. Ah, so it's a little bit louder than stock. That's not a bad sound at all. So we got windows up and let's go for a first drive over back to our spot. That way we can kind of get my first real impressions, nothing fake, nothing after the fact of how this all sounds. And then we'll get some revs. We'll wrap up this video, but Installation is really straightforward, very easy. Okay, that sounds good. I didn't want it to be like really like obnoxious sounding. I didn't know how loud it was gonna be. Of course we want it as deep as possible and so far first impressions are, yeah, it's pretty deep. So let's get on the road here. Okay, so it's a little bit louder than factory so but it's not like the extreme system on my mustang gt's which is good that's a good thing because that means that we can live with this every day all day long and it's going to be pleasant for your ears it's going to be pleasant for passengers and stuff like that so this is not going to beat you up it's not going to drown you out on the like road trips on the highway or anything like that so here we are cruising about 50 mile an hour and I don't even hear the exhaust. So that means that we have no drone. That's always a major plus when you go with an aftermarket exhaust. So this one is definitely, definitely got me impressed. Let's give it a little gas now. Let's see if we can give it a little bit of, a little wide open throttle pull here. Okay. So not bad. That is not bad at all. That sounds pretty good. So a little bit louder than factory, but definitely a deep note, which is a plus because we don't have the V8 in this, we have the 3.5. So can you make a 3.5 EcoBoost sound good? Yes, if you go with this exhaust. Let's get the windows down real quick. Just, just gonna crack them. Let's see if we can do that again. Let's slow down here and we're gonna nail it. Ah, you hear a little turbo. That's good sounding. That sounds delicious. So a little bit more turbo noise. That's interesting. But again, not an overbearing exhaust. So this is definitely worth the price, I think. I'm enjoying this. All right, let's get over here, pull off the side of the road and get some rev action and some flybys. So you guys can hear what this sounds like. But inside of the cabin, this is the ticket.
Now, we have, of course, on both the Mustang and the F-150, and they both sound good. This one's very livable. I'm impressed by it. Sounds deep, no drone, and it's not overbearing. But with the Mustang, of course, we want you know, no drone, but we want obnoxious, and we have that. And then you guys saw, we teased the headers for the Mustang that's gonna be going on very soon, whenever the boost comes in, that's coming as well. But we have more stuff to install under the hood, a little bit more power and something else, another little secret to go under the hood of our new F-150. So stay tuned for the next video of this truck and the adventure to come. But that's the video, I love it. Go check out the video links down below if you are interested in a setup like this. Until next video, guys, God bless all of you. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.